Welcome to the Honor Video Module on Pay.gov. Pay.gov is a free of charge U.S. Treasury run website that allows payers to make one-time ACH payments to Honor. Payers have the option of registering with the website if they want to save their payment information or access their payment history. Pay.gov is open 24 hours a day, seven days a week, including holidays, and your payment is received usually within 24 to 48 hours upon submitting payment through pay.gov. To access Honor's payment forms, go to www.pay.gov and then simply click in the search box on the top left part of the screen. Type ONRR in the box and click search. There are four different payment forms available for you to pay Honor through pay.gov. The first form is used to pay acquisition fees and renewable energy payment. The second is used to pay initial right-of-way or right-of-use rental payments. The third form is for renewable energy initial rental payments. The fourth and most commonly used form is used to pay honor royalty and invoice payments. This video will focus on how to make a payment using the royalty and invoice payments form. To access the form, click on the hyperlink. This will open up a new page. Under Acceptable Payment Methods, click on Continue to the form. The form contains all of the fields necessary for Honor to process the payment corresponding to your Honor FM-2014 PNR document or Honor invoice. Written instructions are also available by clicking on the Click for Instructions hyperlink just above the field boxes. The first required field is the business unit. This field has a drop-down menu with two options. F for federal payment and I for Indian payment. Select one based on your PNR document 2014 or the Honor invoice. For Honor invoices, check the upper right hand corner of your invoice to locate the business unit. FED01 is for federal and IND01 is for Indian. When Indian payments are selected, the distributed code field will be available at the bottom of the form. Next field on the form is payer code. Payer codes are five digits and listed as the customer number on an invoice or payer code on a Honor FM-2014 or PNR document. Solids PNR document payer codes will begin with MA. The third field is payer name. Enter the name of your company. The field is limited to 15 characters, so you can abbreviate if necessary. The next field is payment type. There are two payment types available. The first is a royalty payment. Select a royalty payment option if you're making a 2014 or a PNR document payment. The second is an invoice payment. If you are paying an invoice from Honor, select invoice payment. It is important to select invoice payment in order for the pad or invoice field to expand from 8 to 12 characters to accommodate an honor invoice number in the next step. The fifth field is pad, payer assigned document number or invoice number field. Up to 8 characters are available to accommodate a pad or PAR number. Invoice numbers are 12 characters long and consist of 3 letters followed by 9 numbers. Invoice numbers are located in the upper right hand corner of your invoice. The next field is the total amount paid field. Enter the amount that you wish to pay to honor. The amount should exactly match the amount on the 2014 PNR document or the invoice. If you selected I for Indian payment as the business unit field, the final field is the distributed code. If you selected F for federal payment as the business unit, this drop-down field will not appear. The drop-down list contains a list of available distributed codes. Select the corresponding distributed code that ties back to your PNR document 2014 or invoice. A crosswalk of least numbers to distributed codes is available at the link shown on your screen. At the bottom of the page, the first button is an option to reset the entire form and start over. The second button will provide you with a PDF version of the payment form for your record. The third button is a continue button to advance your payment into the enter payment info page. Click continue. 
You are now on the Enter Payment Info page. If you are not registered with the website, the form will be blank. If you register, this information is populated in the appropriate field. Enter the payment amount. In the form, you will enter the name of the account holder, select the account type, which can be a business checking or a savings account, or a personal savings or checking account. Enter the routing number for your financial institution. Then enter your account number and re-enter it in the next box. When you are done, at the bottom of the page, you have the option to return to the previous page, return to the form, or cancel, or review and submit. To continue your payment, click on the Review and Submit Payment button. The Review and Submit screen allows you to review your payment information before you submit your payment. Click the checkbox to receive an email confirmation. You must enter an email address twice to have the email confirmation sent to you. You must then agree with the authorization and disclosure language by clicking the checkbox. Up to this point, you can cancel the ACH request by clicking on the Cancel button, or you can return to your form to make any changes. If you are ready to submit your payment, click on the Submit Payment button. After you submit your payment, a confirmation page will indicate your transaction completed successfully. At this point, you are finished and can close out of the browser or return to the search results to submit another payment. If this video did not cover your situation, or you have additional challenges, we encourage you to contact us with any questions when submitting payments. We are here to help you and determine your options. Honor provides this training as a courtesy. No official support or endorsement by the Department of the Interior, any person or office within the agency, or any other agency of the federal government is intended or should be inferred. Thank you for viewing this training module. If you have any questions on this video or recommendations on future modules, please email us at honorvideomailbox at honor.gov.